Good morning, Fellowship. Uh, welcome to this week's Friday Update. My name is Pastor Brett, and thanks for tuning in today. This Sunday, we're going to be hearing from Pastor Adam, and so I hope you're able to join us either online or in person for that. He's going to be talking about the will of God, and so you won't want to miss that. Also on Sunday, we're having one of our MIFs, our missionaries in the field, will be back. And uh, if you're able to join us in person, you'll be able to see him. Unfortunately, for uh, security reasons, we won't be able to live stream that portion of the service. But uh, please join us on Sunday. If you're able to in person, uh, you'll hear about what God's been doing in East Asia. And so thanks for joining us for that. I want to highlight a couple areas of our ministries that need some volunteers, um, especially our children's ministry. You know, we're having fall kickoff. Uh, Awana starts next week and very quickly. And um, Heather is in some need of more volunteers. And so if you have any desire, any interest uh, in serving as an Awana volunteer, we need about five to six more volunteers in Awana. Uh, even if you don't have interest, please consider uh, serving in Awana. I mean, these kids are really blessed by the Awana material and just learning more about God and being in the environment here. And so we want to serve them. We want to serve them well. And so we want to have a good staff of volunteers. And so please consider uh, joining the Awana team as they serve these kids. Also, on September 20th, we're going to be starting up kids class here at Fellowship, Fellowship Kids. And we need more help there too. And so uh, I think Heather said about five to six volunteers are needed for that as well. So please consider joining those. Um, it's great for parents to be able to bring their kids and, and, and join in in the service wholeheartedly and not have their kids with them. And maybe you're a parent who has kids. Maybe, maybe consider serving once a month so that we can keep that ministry going and, and you can um, you know, at least be in the service hopefully the other three Sundays of the month. And so yeah, please consider joining one of those um, as volunteer. Also, in almost two weeks, a little under two weeks, we have our next free uh, hot cavatelli dinner. And uh, so please consider signing up for that. We need lots of volunteers for that. There are people that go out Tuesday night, the night before, and just go door to door, knocking on people's doors to see if they'd like us to deliver them a meal. It's a little intimidating at first. Um, Morley and I did it last month, my daughter and I. Um, but yeah, we, we had a good time. You know, we got to walk through the neighborhood and people are very appreciative that we would consider giving them a free meal. And so uh, we need volunteers to go out Tuesday night, the night before, which would be the 22nd. And then we need a lot of help during the day with the food prep on the 23rd. And so if you've got any time during the day, even a two, three hour block um, would be a great help. And so please consider that. Um, you should be able to sign up on Sunday on your connection card to serve there. Also, we have the Pray For Me uh, campaign that Matt and the, the youth team, youth leadership are, are putting out for us. And it's a neat way to connect with kids for a whole year and pray for them. And you might wonder, you know, each day when I wake up, what am I going to think to pray for a student about? But um, there's a booklet that comes with it, and it just helps guide you through different things to pray each day. And so it's just a neat opportunity for an adult to get matched up with a specific student and commit to praying for that student for a year. And so if you consider doing that, that would be great. I'm sure Matt would appreciate it, and I know the student would too. And, and you'll be blessed, I'm sure, as well. And so I just want to leave you with a verse today. Um, it's Pastor Adam's verse for this Sunday. It's a long one, so I hope you're ready for it. It's uh, Matthew chapter 6, verse 10, and it says, Your kingdom come, your will be done. So let me just close this in prayer, and then you can get on with your day. Uh, God, we just commit all these needs to you. We're thankful that you are a God who can supply for all of our needs. And Lord, I do just pray that as this verse says, your kingdom come, your will be done. God, we want to be about your work. We want to be about what you're doing. And I just pray that you'd help us to do that. Uh, God, we just thank you for your love for us. Thank you for your goodness to us. Lord, I just pray that you'd um, bless us each day and all that we say, do, and think. May we be honoring to you. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Have a great day and hope to see you Sunday. Thanks.